children today we will discuss about potential potential or some people will say potential difference or some people will say emf apocomotive force all are same directly or indirectly children all are same so let us have a small revision of the older classes in older classes what we discussed children we discussed about the charge and we discussed about the current do you remember children charge means q current means i charge units are coulombs current units are amperes charge formula is q is equal uh, to me and current formula is i is equal to q by t like that we discussed and this is measured by ammeter ammeter is connected to pv is equal to all those all those now potential same we will discuss here potential is denoted by v here q here i there v children here coulombs here amperes and potential units are volts volts and here formula q is equal to me i is equal to q by t and here formula v is equal to w by q what is w by <coughs> q here the definition is rate of flow of charge is called current and here the definition is work done in work 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 done in moving a charge work done in moving a charge is called potential try to understand children work done in moving a charge is called potential and explain everything don't worry just to see all of you okay and potential is measured by volt meter don't say volt meter say volt meter okay here it is ammeter here it is volt meter ammeter is connected in series do you remember i told once up and volt meter is connected in parallel always parallel what is parallel i'll discuss in parallel topic children don't worry why it is connected in series because it has low resistance and why it is connected in parallel because it has high resistance one mark or two marks many times they ask me okay define one ampere do you remember children when i am saying current equal one ampere what is one ampere i told when one coulomb flows for one second it is called one ampere i told here one volt definition when one joule of work is done in moving one coulomb of charge it is called one volt again when one joule of work is done when one joule of work is done in moving one coulomb of charge one by one only one by one, one is it is called one volt it is called one volt now you will get out who what is the source of potential what is the source of potential children anyone what is the source of potential the difference in the what is the source of potential means okay mute your audios mute your audios what is the source of potential the source of potential is cell or battery then you will get doubt sir first what is potential sir please explain to us children i am explaining please listen what is potential children this is a wire this is a bulb will the bulb glow children No. No, because the circuit is not closed. Is here not electron, closed. Uh, closed meter or something. Here electrons are there, children. Here electrons are there, but they are not moving. If they move, only current will come. Here electrons are there. Electrons are there, but they are not moving. To move them, to move them, what will put here, children? What will put? Battery or cell. Battery or cell. If you put battery or cell, immediately electron starts moving and the bulb glows. Then you will get out, sir. What battery is doing? Battery is creating potential difference between this point and this point between A and B. It is creating potential difference. What is potential difference, sir? You ask. Children, see here. If I put my uh, hands uh, straight and the pen is like this, pen is not moving. But if I do like this, pen starts moving. Why? Because pen moves from high region to low region. Water moves from high raised dams to low raised dams. Heat flows from hot body to cold body. Anything moves from up to low only. So initially they used to think that A is at more potential difference, B at the less potential difference. There is potential difference is there. So electron starts moving. When electron starts moving, when electron starts moving, current will come here. When so. What the battery is doing in such children, it is creating some potential difference here, here between these two points. It is creating some difference. They are not balanced children. It is difference is creating due to those difference. Electron starts moving. When electron starts moving, current is coming. When current is coming, bulb is glowing. So 
So bad, what is the source of potential? This is, many people in the exam, they will write a voltmeter and they will come children. No, cellular battery. Potential is measured by voltmeter. But what is the source of potential? Cellular battery. Now what is potential difference? Potential difference means, is the difference in the potential between two points. It is difference in potential between two points. Between two points. Let me say VA minus VB. Let me say VA minus VB. Let me say VA minus VB is equal to same formula is W by Q only. Formula is same only. W by Q means uh, potential, potential at A minus potential at B gives potential difference is equal to W by Q. What then is moving a charge? Who is doing that work? Cell. What work it is doing? It is moving the charge. What work it is doing? It is moving the charge. Who is moving the charge? Cellular battery. So cellular battery is doing the work of moving this charge. That is called potential. Potential is defined as work. Then it moving a charge. This is called potential difference. Now what is EMF? EMF means uh, electromotive force. Electromotive force. Children, when current is flowing, the potential difference is called potential difference. Right? When current is flowing, potential is called potential difference. When current is not flowing also, potential difference will be present, no children. It won't go anywhere. If current is flowing or current is not flowing, potential difference will be there. When current is flowing, <laughs> it is called potential, sorry, potential difference. When current is not flowing, the potential difference is called EMF. What is EMF? It is a potential difference between two terminals when current is not flowing. What is EMF? It is potential difference between two terminals. It is potential difference between two terminals when current is not flowing. When current is not flowing. When current is flowing, potential difference. When current is not flowing, electromotive force. When current is flowing, potential difference. When current is not flowing, electromotive force. This is about potential. Okay, children. So what we studied, potential is not by V, units are volts, formula is V is equal to W by Q. What is the definition? Work done in moving a charge is called potential. Work done in moving a charge is called potential. Work done in moving a charge is called potential. Measured by voltmeter. Voltmeter is always connected in parallel because it has high resistance. Mute your audio. Define one volt. When one joule of work is done in moving one coulomb of charge, it is called one volt. When one joule of work is done in moving one coulomb of charge, it is called one volt. What is the source of potential? Cellular battery. Okay, children. So, potential difference between two points. The potential difference between two points. Okay, children. What is potential difference? It is the difference in the potential between two points. What is potential difference? It is the difference in the potential between two points. If current is flowing, it is potential difference. If current is not flowing, electromotive force. If current is flowing, it is called potential difference. If current is not flowing, it is called electromotive force. Most important questions in this is voltmeter, how it is connected. What is the source of potential and define one volt? Many times they are asking a board exam. Many children, when they ask source, they will write voltmeter. When they ask how it is measured, they will say cellular battery. Correctly wrong answer, they will write, I don't know how they will manage it. Please don't write like that. Remember them clearly and be okay, children. So till now, what were topics which I studied, children? Till now, what were topics we studied? We studied it. Okay. So charge is generated by cube, units are coulombs, formula Q is called any. Current is generated by I, unit. Uh, amperes formula is I is equal to Q by T is measured by ammeter and this connects and seals because it has low resistance. One ampere is one coulomb per one second. Potential is generated by V, units are volts, so V is equal to W by Q. What then it will be charge is called potential, measured by voltmeter, connected in parallel because it has high resistance and one volt definition is when one joule of work is done in moving one coulomb. From the formula only you can write this definition, children. You need not remember also. When one joule of work is done in one coulomb of charge, it is called one volt. And source is cellular battery. Potential difference, pot difference in the potential between two points is called potential difference. And potential difference when current is not flowing is called EMF. Potential difference when current is not flowing is called EMF. EMF means electromotive force. We'll do three four numericals on this children. All three pieces and three four numericals will do children. Small, small numericals, not very big. So potential. Muted by V. Units are volts. V is equal to W by Q and measured by voltmeter. Voltmeter is connected in parallel because it has high resistance. One volt is one joule per one coulomb. Children, we will do some numericals. Small, small numericals we will do, children, so that you will understand what is happening. First question. 
first question is here. Okay, so first question is like this. What is the potential? Okay, description questions are very rejected children later. When 10 joules of work is done in moving 10 coulombs of charge. Anyone answer? Answer? Anyone? W by Q 10 by 10 is 1. 1. So one. V is equal to W. 1, sir. Yeah, 1. 10 by 10, that is 1 volt. That's a simple sum, children, for your understanding. That's it. One more question, children, those who didn't understand, please check, children. Direct sum. What is the potential? When 50 joules of work is done in moving, in moving, 10 to the power of 19 electrons. One second, children, not 50 joules, children, this is 3.2 joules, 3.2 joules, children. Anyone? V is equal to W by Q. Sir, Q is equal to N formula, sir, first. Yes. 1.6 the Yes, children. 3.2 joules by... Sir, Q is equal to 1.6, sir. Coulombs. Yeah, please see here, all of you. So, V is equal to W by Q. W, how much I gave, children? 3.2 joules. Anyone? 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 3.2 by n is how much children I gave? 10 to the power of 10. 19. And what is the charge of electron? 1.6 into 10, 10 to the power of 19. Plus 19 minus 19? Cancel. Cut. 2. 2, sir. 2. 2 volt is the answer. Right, that children. Simple sum, children. Very, very easy. Only thing is you have to understand the theory, children. This much clear cut theory in textbook, you won't get children. Why? Right? Everything is aggregated like a theory they will ship. But I am telling here for you as a point so that you will never forget. Even in the second year, again, all these questions will come, children. How much work, children, how much work is done to move 10 to the power of 19 electrons across a potential difference of 220 volts? So, children, V is equal to W by Q. Q. Q is equal to Q. No, no, mute your audio, I'm getting distance. W is equal to VQ, children. So Q is equal to N E V. Okay, children. Because Q is equal to N E V, children. First only we discuss in charge. So N is how much I gave? 10 to the power of 10 19. To the power of 19. E is how much? 1.6 into 10 to the power of minus 19 into 220. This, this gone, children. 62 to 32. 352 joules of work is done in moving this many electrons across this much potential difference. If you want to move this many electrons across this much potential difference, this much work you have to do. How much? 352 joules. I hope you are enjoying physics, children. Okay, next time. One more time, children. Please, children, try to understand the more. Find the amount of potential at a point B. Find the amount of potential at point B. If uh, at point A it is 10 volt uh, and the work done is 20 joules to move the charge of uh, 5 coulomb. Potential difference formula we should use. Children. What is the potential difference formula? V a minus v a minus VB is equal to W by Q. Very good. What is V A children? 10. 10. What is VB? You should find out. What is W? 20 joules. By 5. So 10 minus V is equal to 4. four. This comes here, this goes there. So six. V is equal to 6 joules at point V. At point V, 6 joules is there. I told you, children, what is potential difference definition? I told difference in the potential between two points. What is the potential difference def def uh, definition? Difference in the potential between two points. Difference in the potential between two points. Difference in the potential between two points. I'm repeating so many times so that uh, you will never forget here. You'll always remember, children. Difference, difference in the potential between two points. One more summary, children, for your understanding. How many sums means that many sums you have, children, in the description. Please check the description and keep on working out each topic. You listen to each topic video, and make your own notes, keep doing it. So that you'll have proper understanding, children. Okay, fifth question. Okay, fifth question, children. How much charge flows when potential difference of 220 volt and 11 joules of work is done? Basic question, children. Basic question. Anyone wants to tell me? 
seven by two twenty. V is equal to sir. W by Q. V is equal to W by Q. Q is equal to two twenty is equal to eleven by eleven by n into. Okay, this goes here. This goes here. So Q is equal to eleven by two twenty. Q is equal to one by twenty. That is zero point zero five coulombs. Zero point zero five coulombs. See, means coulombs. You know, don't uh, okay. Don't panic for that. Relax. Zero point zero five coulombs. So, children, this is uh, some numericals on uh, potential children. Anyone have any doubt on potential children? You can ask me and prove me everything.